Yo, what is going on guys? It's Bato here. Welcome back to another Call of Duty video. Yeah, I know Call of Duty. Yeah, it's so exciting, isn't it? No, like I, I know it's not exciting as maybe any other game, but like, let's be honest, there's like no games out right now. Like I was actually looking through GameStop logs right now to try to figure out what game I could buy and make a video on. Like there's really nothing that I could do but play Call of Duty. Like I even tried playing a Friday, I tried playing Friday the 13th right before this game. I played for like half an hour to an hour and nothing really happened. Like I, I guess like it really wasn't as fun because of the people I was playing with or something like that. I don't know. So I figured screw it, you know, we're gonna play another Call of Duty video. It seems like you guys really enjoyed it though because you know, it's been a while since I played and made a video. You guys showed so much support on yesterday's video and I really appreciate that. It means the world coming from you guys. And like the more that support you guys show, it, it just, it amazes me because it also gets my channel out there and get, finds more people to come and uh, support me as well. And, you you know that's like a really big step to the direction that I'm trying to go in so thank you guys all for yesterday's video it was awesome so anyway you're probably gonna see for the past couple of days or the next couple of days you're gonna see me in like the same shirt for the next video or a couple days for like the next videos that I post because I'm gonna be trying to post wait or upload because I'm gonna be trying to make a couple of videos for one day because I'm gonna be hanging out with my girlfriend this weekend because I'm always with her every weekend just like I said to you guys the other way you know I'm very uh, self-conscious when it comes to making videos so I'm probably I'm more than like 99% sure I'm not gonna be making videos in front of her unless like we we do a video together i'm not sure yet there's a bunch of video ideas actually that i was thinking about doing someone actually suggested i do a q a but i think if i do another q a i kind of want to do it by myself but i might do it with her i might do it with someone else it all depends like you guys let me know i think i'm gonna do it by myself honestly but i'm gonna have the videos up probably like not every day maybe like every other day or something like that because like i, I don't really think i'm gonna be a daily poster anymore i'm probably just gonna post like every other day or every two days or something like that so i'm probably gonna make like three videos today because right now it's wednesday and i gotta pick her up thursday uh, afternoon so i'm gonna make like three videos now and then you know those are gonna be my video set for the weekend and then once the day comes back then I will go back to the daily post or something like that I don't know I'm still trying to work out how my schedule should work when it comes to posting videos because I know every, like Call of Duty every single day is gonna get boring and I don't really have any other game that I could switch it up with to make it more entertaining like Jev he has Injustice 2 and Friday the 13th I, I can't make videos on Friday the 13th as for Injustice 2, I can't really make Injustice 2 videos because I don't have the game. It's expensive, and I'm pretty sure people are getting worn out on it. Plus, everyone already calls me a Jev wannabe, so I'm pretty sure doing that would make me having more Jev wannabe comments. I don't, I don't know how I'm like Jev. I just play Call of Duty and talk what it's on my mind. I mean, I, I guess that's every YouTuber actually. But I mean, hey, if you guys want to compare me to Jev, I'm totally fine with that because he's like my idol. So I just got back from Wendy's like about an hour ago, dude, and it was so bomb, dude. Like I don't, I don't understand. Like you guys do not understand how bomb Wendy's is. Like I went to Wendy's and I got two crispy chicken sandwiches. Yo, their crispy chickens are like the best food ever like uh, okay hold on hold let's pause right there you guys already know that mcdonald's is the top thing for me so let's like not even cut that off so you know so you know obviously if i say it's the best it's not better than mcdonald's but it is amazing it feels so good going to like a new restaurant and they actually get your order right like ever since like like i've been going to mcdonald's for many many years and they've gotten more orders wrong than right really sad to see my best restaurant or my favorite restaurant do like the most dumbest things ever i went to wendy's many times and they always get my order right they never get it wrong but i mean mcdonald's man really I'm out here trying to like sponsor you and you know eat and say how bomb you guys are and you're gonna give me bad service I'm surprised I don't have like an MVP gift card already going I mean, come on usually when I go to McDonald's so they never really mess up on my order it's everybody else's order that order that they mess up or like if I get something for myself the only thing they'll mess up is pretty much like my fries or my drink they don't ever mess up my nuggets because you don't you don't you don't touch another man's nuggets you know you get them right usually it's like we're missing a burger or something like that or the fry is small and we ordered a large or like the drink is a sprite and we ordered a coke you know like some some dumb like that but what happened the other day at McDonald's was probably my worst experience ever and it really pissed me off but you know it made me so angry just what they did to me it made me not want to go to McDonald's ever again but I mean that that's my that's my that's my life yo like I can't I can't I can't leave you know that's I, I gotta stay I've had them for in my entire life McDonald's has always been there for me yo I swear McDonald's you I m McDonald's made the fluffy person you see as of you right now like it wasn't really anything crazy but it was something that kind of made me mad a little bit right so we went to McDonald's right and they, I ordered my 10 piece chicken nugget right? I got the number seven large 10 piece chicken nugget large fries large coke now here's what pissed me off right at the back it's not only did i just say my order i said can i get a 10 piece large with a coke they said we don't have soda what mcdonald's does not have soda like you're not gonna have soda at a fast food restaurant that has like like i, I just at a fast food restaurant period like you don't have soda right off the bat like you don't have soda like how, what what that's like going to a cow and saying hey dude we're out of milk like what what so the girl told me when i was playing she was like yeah we don't have soda but i can get you a sweet tea an unsweetened tea or an iced coffee but i will not charge you for the iced coffee i was like wow if i was someone who loved iced coffee i'd be happy as hell but i do not like coffee so you know i don't want coffee i got a sweet tea i was like dude there's no way that mcdonald's can get worse than this like it was already bad enough that they didn't have soda so i got my order and i checked it right i had all the burgers 
burgers, it had the fries. There was a box under the burgers, which you you know naturally is what chicken nuggets come in. They come in a box, right? I checked it and I saw the box and I assumed it was my chicken nuggets, which obviously it wasn't, which made me pissed off. And I automatically assumed that it was my chicken nuggets. So I went home, I got everything out of the bag, and it wasn't a freaking it wasn't even chicken nuggets, it was a double quarter pounder with like everything on it. And I I don't like everything. If I didn't mind quarter pounders, I wouldn't even have mind eating it. I would have been like, oh well, I mean that must be a sign that I'm fat or something like that. Might as well eat the burger. The burger had everything on it. I don't, I don't like that. It's meat and cheese only, yo. It's only meat and cheese. That's it. Sometimes I'll put lettuce, but I mean, come on. That ruined my day. And my brother loves quarter pounders, so what I did was I cleaned it off and I told him that it came plain, which it didn't. Because if you clean it off, but tell him there's stuff on it, then he he throws a little baby fit and says like, oh, I can still taste it. No, you can't. Shut up. No, so I switched to his burger. I, I gave him the double quarter pounder and I took one of his little McDoubles. That's it. Like it was like a dollar burger. It made me so mad because how do you forget chicken nuggets? Like how? How? I'm nothing but a fat man ranting about about food, yo. Like I swear. But uh, yeah, I guess that means you know if you ever go to a fast food restaurant always check your orders because I, i'm definitely gonna be checking my orders my mom told me so many times to check your orders and i never did and now i'm gonna start checking my orders after that but uh you know anyway uh, I apologize for the short video or actually it probably wasn't that short actually but I also have another video I talked about two things in this video actually but I'm gonna put that one into a separate one because I think it it's actually long enough for a second video so you're gonna see like kind of like the same thing but in like two separate videos because if I put it together it would have been like maybe like a four like 13 14 minute long video so I'm separating them right now but uh you know anyway thank you guys for watching I hope you guys did enjoy please remember to leave a like if you guys did and subscribe if you guys are new what's your worst experience at what restaurant like where did you go and where did they like mess up the most all right so you guys let me know about that in the comments below also one more thing i also got this thing for my phone all right i didn't i didn't really tell anybody but i got this all right i plug it into my iphone and i can plug it in hdmi here and record videos on my phone or i can live stream i want you guys to let me know what you think about that in the comments if i were to do that if i were to live stream like eight ball pool blue and tower defense battles etc or make videos on them just me chilling or something like that i don't know i could always make it entertain entertaining if you guys gave it a shot you know and uh, also, I do have a live me account. I will try to stream on it as much as possible. If you guys want to check it out, the link to it will be in the description. It's an app, so you have to download the app and then follow me. Actually, so I don't think there will be a link. I'll just put a picture of my profile right here, and you guys can look for that. I think it's it's Vato. That's it. So, you know, anyway, it's long as outro. I love you guys so much. Hope you have a fantastic day today. And Vato is out. Peace. Now they always say congratulations. Work so hard, forgot how to vacation.